Welcome back to Mike's Man Cave and welcome back to another video. This one is sort of barbecue related and what we're trying to work out today is how well the cheapest fire lighters at Bunnings work. Now as you just saw I just bought these at Bunnings earlier today and they were by far the cheapest fire lighters they had. It's a 36 pack for barbecues, outdoor fireplaces, and indoor fireplaces. There you go, the cheapest fire lighters at Bunnings. Let's see how they go. Okay, here we are. Let's unwrap these things. You've got little cubes there. You've got little brake lines. And for something like this here, I normally just like to put a whole row in each one, so you'll see how to do it. I've got videos on this already. This video is mainly about testing out the cheapest fire lighters at Bunnings. So let's... They never break right. This always happens. And I've got to say, it's not the fault of these particular ones. They all do the same thing, even if you buy the most expensive fire lighters at Bunnings. Okay, so we used one row on each side there. So that's one row, that's another row. And now we wait. Now, this is what the coals look like after exactly 15 minutes. Now, if you're lighting a charcoal barbecue, it is always a great idea to count your coal lighting time into your cooking time. So it doesn't matter if it takes 15 minutes to light your coals or an hour, as long as you know that's how long it takes and you start your barbecue in time to prepare your meal. So the question was, do the cheapest fire lighters at Bunnings work? What do you guys say? Leave a comment down below. Now, if you enjoyed this video at all and found it useful, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up and don't forget to smash the subscribe button for more videos from Mike's Man Cave. Thanks for watching and bye for now.